Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. The Natchez Little Theater Association, an amateur group, was functioning in Natchez as early as 1808, only two years after the performance in the city tavern of The Provoked Husband, the earliest known professional play to be given in English west of the Alleghenies. The association fitted up an old Spanish hospital near the present site of Rosalie, but by 1812, the organization had built its own theater, seating 500 on the bluff at the northern end of the old parade ground. Admission charges were $1, with children admitted at half price. When the Playhouse was enlarged in 1819 to provide box seats for season ticket holders, naturally, since it is Natchez, a bar was added as well. Throughout the 1800s, riverboat shows stopped and performed. Natchez welcomed such actors and performers as Junius Brutus Booth, the father of John Wilkes Booth, Jenny Lynn, acclaimed operatic soprano, and William S. Hart, America's first Western movie star. Even Sarah Bernhardt appeared here at the Baker Grand in 1917. In 1932, a group of local citizens met to organize the Little Theater of Natchez, making this the oldest community theater in the state of Mississippi. Their first production was a one-act play, The Florist, which had been performed earlier in the 1920s. The Natchez Little Theater was organized and incorporated as a nonprofit organization in 1948, and shows were held at the Braden School Auditorium. In 1969, Natchez Little Theater, under board president Jack Milstein, purchased the Wesley Methodist Church at 319 Linton Avenue. Mayweather Hall, the former parsonage next door, and a lot on Maple Street were added to Natchez Little Theater's property acquisitions. The first play produced at Natchez Little Theater's present home was Murder, My Sweet Matilda. Since 1932, Natchez Little Theater has produced over 500 plays for over 800,000 international patrons. Natchez Little Theater is the most active charitable nonprofit volunteer community theater in the nation, playing to an annual audience of over 23,000 from around the world. Hi, I'm Lane Taylor, Natchez Little Theater's Artistic and Executive Director, waiting for my next close-up. And this has been your Natchez History Minute.